Hey everybody, it's Helgia, and welcome back to the realm of Israelia. Um, it's just me again today, um, but as you can see, I actually got enough bookshelves here to actually do a level 30 enchant. I went, what I did off camera, okay, first things first. I did stone off camera, because I didn't think you guys wanted to watch me forge a bunch of stone over and over. I just kind of like cleared a little path in the place I said I was going to, and like got some stone around the area, and made a good amount of stone to go and start the wall. Um, we did the bookshelves, of course. I did quartz mining. I got 64 blocks to get up to 30 levels. And as I was out at night, I found two endermen, so I went ahead and fought them, and I actually got two ender pearls. And uh, yeah, we got the blaze rod last last episode, I believe. So what I'm gonna do now is I'm gonna go. Oh, and I got two more obsidian because I didn't think you guys wanted to watch me go get two more obsidian. So, but um, I went ahead and got that. Um, we're gonna go ahead and we're going to make an eye of ender. And actually make our ender chest. Papawee! And I'll show you what we got inside of it. Um, for now, I hope you can get an ender chest back after you drop it down somewhere. Huh. I wonder if that's a thing. I hope so. I really do. I mean, I have another ender pearl and blaze rod, so it wouldn't be too hard for me to go and get. Let's just go ahead. Let's go ahead and do it. Alright, so what's in here? is spawn eggs which I will give out for people who do tasks and stuff um, we have a skeleton skull which I'm gonna put on the actual altar of our like little church that we're gonna make um, and uh, we have name tags the name tags will give out with spawn eggs for the main reason of people might want to use the skeletons as like a sentry for their base and unless they're name tagged Minecraft despawns mobs so when they log out or after they leave their base for a little bit, those mobs won't be there anymore. So if they name tag them, then they can name them whatever they want. I don't care. Well, it's fine. <laughs> but yeah, um, they name them, they won't despawn. So we can actually use them to protect our bases and stuff. So that's the reason that like I think me, Seal, and Chili are going to give out name tags as well as spawn eggs. But yeah, um, we've chosen new chests, of course, because nobody else can get to our shit. So nobody can just come in and steal it. And we're the only ones that are opt, so we're the only ones that can grab spawn eggs and stuff. Because, uh, you know, we'll invite, like, new people to it, and we don't, we, like, we, we're inviting people that, like, seem like really cool people and stuff, but you never know, so it's always better to be cautious. So, since we have a level 30 enchanting, and I got 30 levels from course mining, we're gonna go ahead, and we're just gonna do this a couple times. And come on. I want a really good first 30 enchant. Really good one. We're gonna do this. Unbreaking three efficiency for uh I guess that's alright. I mean I didn't really even enchant the one I really wanted to. Like I'm saving um this guy right here to do a level thirty enchant too. So we'll leave him in here and we'll just use him for now as like a main pickaxe kind of thing. I also have these two I just enchanted to help with the uh, stone mining. Alright, so we got that done. Um, we got the ender chest down. So what I want to do is I want to go ahead and gather all this up. Um, bring a lot of food with me. I don't need flint and steel. I don't need that. Um, yeah. I'm just going to organize this real quick. Sorry, we're quiet. Put this and this and this and this little area. Alright, so what we're going to do is we're going to go back over to that area. Um, I still have to clear it a little bit, but not too much. You know what I really need to do? <laughs> I really need to put a fucking bed down, so let's do that first. So that if I die, I don't have to come all the way back here. Alright, so we've got one piece of wool here, one piece of wool here, and then there's this one here. I'm going to have a multicolored bed. Yay! Alright, so whoop. Got a bed. Um... I'm gonna go ahead and just put it here next to the enchant. This is nowhere near a um a permanent base. I'm just putting stuff here to have a place to go right now. Um but I'm gonna go on ahead. Oh and um shit. Why is he attacking me? Oh, okay, I guess he's not. We figured out how to um keep the mobs from attacking us, so we don't have to worry about that anymore. I think that was an issue that we came up with in like the first recording session. But that has been solved. Hi creepers, don't come after me please. Alright, let's get over here. I did clear a little bit of where I want the wall. You can see some cobblestone there where I was kinda like lining up where I want the wall to go. Cause it is gonna turn in that way too. 
So we're going to go from like this ridge here over and turn in. And then I'm going to try to make some like staircase once we actually have the wall up. Going to our base here. Oh, I should have cleared it all the way to that wall actually. Didn't think of that. Alright, let's go over here real quick. Because I want it to be like at least like a good height. I don't want it to be too tall because I do want the first like... Um, I have to talk to Chili and Seal tonight about it because I believe we're all going to probably get on. Um, we do have somebody new joining, so that's cool. But um, I do want to make it tall enough so that like my first like five eggs or whatever I get from like the ender chest I just got or whatever, um, I can name tag them up and um, go ahead and put like three on top of the wall. And then the other ones I will pretty much... Um, use for like my home base like I'll put three on the wall and like two in my home base or something like that that way we kinda have like a cool little like sentry wall thing going on alright so what I wanna do we wanna build this across and then when we get across hmm, I'm wondering if I should just do it like I think I wanna do it too thick and actually I don't even need to worry about doing all of that like that but I do want to do it too thick so that I can kind of make them a little area to stand on up here. No, man, I'm fucking it up. So that we can do this. Then I want to do like this kind of a thing all the way across. So it's kind of like a castle wall. Not like that. But like this. So skip a block, go. Skip a block, go. That kind of thing. And then when we do the two layers on it. I will probably get some fences as well for up there so that they stay. Alright, let's uh just get the wall to the, the point where I need it. But yeah, and then whoop, whoop, whoop. We'll have that all the way across like that. And what I can do is like in little parts of it just kinda like have a fence kind of thing, like here, here, and here or something. Maybe put one behind it so that the archer will stay. Then we can have an archer sitting here, which I think is really cool. And then we have kind of like a little gate into our own little like world over here, our own little skelly world. All right, so I'm not gonna really worry about digging up all the stone because I kind of want it to look like it's going into the mountain a bit anyway. Boom. And this is why I have shit tons of stone because <laughs> it is gonna go to there, and then cause we're gonna go from here. And I'm going to make like a main entrance in this part somewhere, like maybe right here in the middle, going up. And then we're going to put the temple up there, and we'll make like a staircase path at some point that goes there. Um, my house, I think I decided when I was like over here mining that I was going to do it over there, just because I like the little like plains looking thing. So I'm going to make my house over that way. And we're going to have this wall go here. And then eventually after I get my house built, maybe I'll just extend the wall a little bit that way. And we'll use the ocean as like a natural wall kind of thing. But yeah. For now, this is just a cool looking, um, cool looking way for me to uh, let people into the, the temple and stuff. And make it look kind of defended. I'm going to leave that bedrock down there. It does look a little like, it's like, been worked on going into the mountain kind of thing, so that's cool.
Yeah, meh, meh. Alright, for now we'll keep it at that. Um, we're gonna go ahead and do a wall thing. It's not impenetrable, it's not really meant to be. I'm not like trying to keep people out, I just think this looks really cool. So, that's why I'm doing it. If I was trying to keep people out, then I would have gotten way more snow, and I would make it way taller, and then I would be really like actually planning out how to, uh, how to make things like not get in. Probably just roof the whole thing or something. <laughs> but this is a cool looking wall, so. It'll look cool from the outside, and then you'll feel like slightly protected from the inside, maybe. But yeah, okay. So this is gonna be our little gateway in. So let's decide where. Like, the door would probably be good right there. What I wanna do for the door is I wanna go up, like, this maybe. And make it like a bigger door so that you don't feel like it's like this tiny thing and do like that and then just clear this whole thing out and then maybe we can get some of that quartz and we can actually make like a doorway here and this way we can kind of be like boom 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 that's our like main center doorway maybe even knock these off Alright, what I think we're going to do, we can go get our quartz now. Yeah. I'm going to get some quartz, I'm going to get two doors. I'd like to do iron doors, maybe? And then just make a pressure plate out, and then maybe like a button in kind of thing. I'll take you real quick so I can spread back. And it's turning nighttime, since I'm the only one on here, I'll just sleep again. So I don't have to deal with any of Chili's and Seal's people, man. <laughs> Let's go. Let's go do this shit. And then, um, I might actually work in my house, or I might work in my house tonight when, uh, we're playing with them guys. Um, I'll just get this, like, as a shorter episode so that we can get our wall set up and, like, kind of designed and stuff. Because I think, um, after I get my house built tonight or whenever I do it, um, the moving I'll do maybe off camera because I don't think you guys want to see me move two full chests of shit and an inner chest and all this. Hopefully... This doesn't break when we break it. Hopefully we get it back. I really do. Maybe we'll test it now. Oh, you just get the obsidian back. Alright, well that's good to know. At least we have a backup of both. So we're gonna just not put another one down. Cause that that is a surprise to me. I didn't know you just got obsidian back when you mined it out. Alright. I, I guess if it's a silk touch pickaxe I'd probably get it back, but um We'll keep that in there. We'll make the ender chest again whenever we actually have a solid like place that we want it. I'll probably end up making two eventually. I'll probably make um one for my home and one for the actual temple. Um, but the first one, uh, the first one, let me think. Maybe in my base since that's the first thing I'm building. That way we can actually get started on the whole like giving tasks out thing. And I think the way I'm gonna do tasks, I don't know how they plan on doing it, but I'm just gonna do like tell whoever. And whisper it to him. And then, uh, yeah. The first one. The first one will probably be to find Seal. Seal's base. Just so I can keep an eye on the motherfucker. <laughs> oh, wait, I didn't get what I needed. Shit, I got distracted, man. I got distracted. So, let's take that course with us. I think I'm gonna go ahead and make some half slabs out of, like, this many, maybe. Uh, we'll just do that for now, because I'm not going to use too much. Um, let's get some torches with us, because I want to put torches up there. And maybe make some fences before we go as well. Probably going to need more than that. So let's just use half of this. Get this wood. Um, I had so much wood, now I'm like out of all of it. It's crazy how much wood you go through in this game. Alright, so let's do that. Let's do that. We'll just use those for 12. So we got 61 torches, which is more than enough. Um... Maybe we'll make some fences too. We'll see how we can sort out our whole, uh, the whole little base thing up there. Alright, so let's go. Let's go, let's go, let's go. I should have grabbed five since I had that inner chest open. Oh well. We'll do it tonight whenever I find it so I can talk to them about it. Because I don't want to get it before they have it kind of thing. And then we'll, uh, whatever little thing that we set up here, we'll, uh, go ahead and put our archers in. We'll decide up here what uh 
what areas we want them to sit. Because I'm only going to do three at first, so we'll just do like probably one at the doorway and then one on each corner kind of thing in the beginning. And then as we go, whatever I earn, I'll like stack up there. Or other people can if they want. Let's see if this will work out. Uh, it looks kind of dumb actually, doesn't it? Because I was just going to kind of like fill this little area up. Like that. Um, those look kind of stupid now, thinking about it. What we could do is we could have made some stairs out of these. I think I got enough to make a crafting bench on me. Should have thought about stairs before I thought about half slabs, to be honest. Alright. Oh, I don't have any wood on me. Is there a tree near me? Give me that. I'm put you down here. Whoop! I need to learn to just start using control for sprint instead of double tapping my like up button. That's a giant tree over there, I think. Yeah, it looks like leaves. I was about to say, what the hell is that coming off there? It looks kind of strange. But this whole area is cool. Like with that waterfall and stuff, we have this little like thing happening here. <laughs> All right, so let's do some. stuff. Stairs. I'm just gonna take four for now to test this out before I like waste a bunch on stuff. Then maybe I could do like that. Then we can just do straight down. Then maybe some where it's like so. Hmm. Does that look alright? Maybe we can do like this. That looks really dumb, doesn't it? Let's see what this looks like. You know it would be cool, like if we put black wool behind that, it might actually look semi like a skull face almost. Let's see what I can do here. Like some black wool there might look kinda cool. Kinda look kinda bony. I might try that. I don't know if I have enough black wool, but what I can do is kill you. And then there's some sheep down here as well. That's some black wool. That's two black wool. Nice. It wants me to do this. Alright, so what we'll do. This is all just like me fucking like trying to make something look good. Because I'm not like incredibly good at building or anything. So we'll just see what I can pull off here. But I just got that white wool too. Because I think if I find like a squid I can just go ahead and dye it. Uh, go up the thingy. Yeah, alright. I know it probably would have been way better if I- Wait, I didn't get that? Wait, you dropped me black wool, right? How did I not get any black wool from that? Is this the last one I killed? that to be some black wool somewhere. That gave me no black wool. Is that a squid down there? That is. Okay, let's go. Squiddy, 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 squiddy. Come on, die. Thank you. Give me them. Alright, go, 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 go. <laughs> I don't want to drown, mommy. Alright. Made it. Cool. I'm just gonna go ahead and climb. I don't feel like swimming up this stupid waterfall. Whoop, whoop. Let's go, let's go, let's go. Alright, so. A two insects. I think I only need. It looks so gross on the fucking. on this, uh, texture pack. What <laughs> veiny ball sack look. <laughs> That's what it looks like. <laughs> Alright, um. Can I mine? Yeah, I can mine that out. Okay, can I mine this one out? Can I mine this one out? Alright, so. We need three, damn it. But is that gonna look good? That look kinda cool. That'll be a cool little, like, doorway thing. See if I have any more wool since I have a little bit more uh, ink sacks and I'll go sheep hunting a bit too. Let's get this wall done. It might be like really cool is if um when they start like the neck or whatever patches in Minecraft and stuff. If um when your stuff took damage or if like you use something to like do dirt like I just did it actually looked dirty or it actually like started looked looking like cracked and like broken. That would be kind of cut like tight, just a cool little like um thing like that. All right, I need a one here as well. So boom, boom, boom. 
then when you come up you got that and we'll do like this real quick be like how oh, can I not put a torch in there oh, I don't think I can put a torch in there oh that would be really cool too we'll just do that for now then alright so maybe since it's turning night we're gonna run home uh, we're gonna make some iron doors and like some two pressure plates and maybe two buttons and then um we will work on our uh, top part put some torches up there and put some um some areas for our archers to stand I still want to keep it only too thick I'm not gonna make it like four or five thick just to put an archer down and put fences around it so right, where did I put my base at? base is in here I believe oh hi steals people you can not do that that'd be cool Ow! steal your people are dicks <laughs> Ah, oh, shit, man. Shit, man. Alright, there we go. So we got an ink sack. I don't want it right now. Um, I'm not going to use any quartz right now. Put all this away. Yeah, I didn't even use all the stone. Cool. I can use that for part of my house or something then. Because I do like using stone. Um, I'll probably just use it as part of a design, though. Um, put this in here. Put this up here. Uh, let's see what we can do. We want iron doors, so I think I have a lot more here for iron. One, two, two iron doors. Put that away. Actually, we'll use you for probably pressure blades? That's stone slab. Pressure blade. Shit. <laughs> I need more. Um, can I do just a regular pressure plate with this? Nope, gotta cook it. Alright, we'll just wait on that then. Um, actually, let's do one more on top of that. Put you away. No, put you in. No, there we go. Alright, cool. And some point whenever they get on, um, I'll start my house and some farm and all that later tonight after we introduce the new person into the world of Israelia. Or realm or whatever. <laughs> whatever we're calling this. And then this, and two pressure plates. So now we've got all of this ready to go. Hey, Chili joined. What's up, motherfucker? <laughs> yeah. Oh shit, man. Alright, so... I'll go ahead and block this off so I am I'm a daddy fucker not mother <laughs> god <laughs> no YouTube knows no <laughs> that was great holy fuck So many zombies chilling out here, man. Holy shit. Fucking. Look, Chili gets on and then all the zombies attack me. This is a conspiracy, man. Oh crap, I'm so uncapped. Damn it, motherfucker! Stop it! Stop it! Fuck off! Stop it! Get off your chicken! Okay. Fuck, man. <laughs> Does it matter? Boom, people. That's. <laughs> uh, Chili, you're amazing. Trying to type him, and then there's just like endless hordes of zombies. It's annoying, man. Alright, so I'm gonna go ahead. Yes. Two pressure plates to get out. 
cool. Put a button here. We'll put a button here. So you can just do that. Come in. There you go. That's not bad. <laughs> yeah. Yeah. Now we don't have to up everyone. Alright, cool. Just for the second that they actually do slash MT. Because it's plugins permissions suck. Um, actually, I should probably put these on top, shouldn't I? Yeah, like this. It's like a fucking flashing beacon of where I am now, but it's not so bad. Cool. We got the scaly wall going. And either we can make the path go up to the top of the mountain for the skeleton thing. Uh, people can build in here, and I'm going to build over there. But for now, that's really cool. Um, shit, did I not bring my fences? Oh, I put all my stuff away, didn't I? I can't rest now either, damn man. Alright, I'm going to go ahead and just ignore these zombies. I'm tired of aggroing everything in sight. And actually, Seal went ahead and made us like a crest for this. Um, it'll probably be on the thumbnails for like whenever we get these videos out. But um, it looks really cool. <laughs> I think eventually, if this series does take off and people love it, I want to put it on like a red bubble shirt. And then people can get it. It'd be really cool. Boom. Yep, I saw that creeper too. He's going to blow up the entrance to this as soon as I leave. I'm not going to be happy. Alright, so. Wait, I'm just hoping on to do some village work. Yeah, I'm... My... Village wall. There we go. <laughs> I don't know what I was trying to spell otherwise. Um, God, what do I need? Ew, I'm so bad at this. Alright, fences. Fences. Dances. I made you. You are in this chest and I am not seeing you. Oh, there you are. You can go back, please. Alright, cool. So we're going to go ahead and probably let a creeper in in a second. If I hear it's some running. No! No, one he can't get in there. Yeah, you do. Me and Seal already have ours. Holy shit, that's a lot of creepers. That's like fucking the six, seven creepers. Ouch. Seal, get your people in line. Motherfuckers hurt me. Yeah, go away, please. Come on, Sonny. I should have just slept, but I didn't. That does look pretty cool, though. That looks kind of like, you know, bone-like, so. Oh my god, that lag. There we go. Oh, there's creepers on my wall now. Alright, you need to just fuck off. There you go. Okay, so the first one I'm gonna do is try to, you know, build it above my doorway, which is right here. So we're gonna put him, like, say right there. We'll do like a little standoff thing here. Then we'll kind of just uh, do that so he can't leave, but he'll be kind of just chilling up in this shit. Oh man, that's another problem. I think they can jump on this. Yeah, if he tried, he could probably jump on that, so let's do this. So let's do that and that so he can't jump up here. And then we'll just put torches as kind of a post thing. Cool. That's a, that's a pretty cool thing to keep him there, I think. So, um, next one I'm going to do on the corner, maybe, like this. We'll just put him in this. Not there. Give me that back. It's a bad fence post. It's a bad fence post. I'm going to need more. <laughs> that and that. Put one there. Put a torch on top of you. And then these two, I'll get more fence posts. But yeah, I might continue this tonight um, after I talk to them about the spawn egg thing. And yeah, um, oh wait, let me tell them one thing. Head and put Oh, 
because people are going to need them. Just to let him know so he can do that in, on himself. That'd be cool. Have one up there, have one over there. And then we'll put one down like here somewhere. And we'll just do three in the beginning. Name them something. <laughs> Maybe just name them all Sentry or something. I do that later. Okay. I'm not gonna dispose who it is until they join, so. We kinda kept Krim secret, I guess. <laughs> I guess we kinda kept her secret in the beginning, so I'll keep this person secret till they join, so. Whoop! Okay. So let's just block that off. Tell me in escape if you wish. Alright. Uh, where's Chili at? There's Chili. <laughs> Secretive. Secrets of secretness. Alright, um, the wall, we got the fences, we got stuff for the inner chest. We now know that I can't just fucking go for it, um, on that. I'm gonna go ahead and just enchant, like, well, let's do this. Let's do this first. I had a feeling. Yeah. Here's him. Here's him. Here's that motherfucker. I do want to go ahead and prepare that fully. Then I'm just gonna do like a little enchant on this because it's not like something I'm gonna keep on me. Apparently, if you put a torch on top of a bookshelf, it doesn't work anymore, and then you can just like easily get a level three thing or something. There we go. Protection one. Why not? Ba Bowie. All right. Cool. I still love this skin. I think when we introduce the person tonight, I'll take off all my armor, so it's actually like skeleton key. Alright guys, for now I think that's good. I think um I think we did a lot for this uh this recording session. So um I'm gonna go ahead and just you know, do that for now. So people can't find this that easily. And we'll uh kinda dirt block this off. I'll get some dirt from up here as well. We'll do that real quick. And we'll just kinda dirt block this off while I'm not on. People can't just easily find this shit. I like doing that too, because then they dig in it and they're like, oh, I guess there's nothing here but dirt, and then, you know, leave it alone. It's probably not the most secret in the world, but whatever. Okay, guys, I'm gonna end this episode here. Um, tonight, we'll introduce a new person, we'll record that, and um, then I'll probably start building my actual house over there since we have the wall like semi built, and we'll probably work on defending our little wall a little bit, so. Thank you guys for watching as always, likes, comments, always appreciated, and I will see you on the next recording. Hey guys, if you enjoyed the video, underneath the more video, yeah, pretty cool here. <laughs> and, a real quick, right here, this is Breacher, and my channel, you can post up to them, and over here, it's Twitter, and Twitch, so, you can follow me there. Yeah, peace, see ya! <laughs>